Jamie Benn has been suspended two games for his cross check on Golden Knights captain Mark Stone during the first period of Tuesday night's 4 0 loss to Las Vegas. Benn was assessed a five minute major in a game misconduct at the time. He declined to speak after the game Tuesday, but on Wednesday, Ben offered this explanation. Jack both said, you know, you know, obviously didn't want to take a five minute penalty, but um, you know, the game happens fast. Uh, emotions are high and um, obviously would have liked to to not fell, fall on him and um, I guess use my stick as a landing point. Have you talked with Mark Stone at all since since last night? Uh, no. Um, usually don't talk to other players in a playoff series on other teams, but uh, you know, I saw he was okay, so that was great. All right, so he, here's Craig Button uh, to talk about the Jamie Benn suspension. First of all, we just heard Jamie Benn, uh, his excuse. He said uh, he's falling down, bracing himself with a stick. I laughed when I heard it. I'm curious to get your, I'm curious to get your reaction to that. <laughs> well, now I understand. I understand now, Jay, why he didn't talk after the game. He, he was trying to concoct something so outrageous, so outlandish, that he, he couldn't speak after the game. And then, sure enough, he comes out and speaks today and says that. How preposterous. Like, you're better off. He should have said nothing today, just like he said nothing last night. Yep. Bottom line for Jamie Benn. It's a, it, it, it's a it's not the heat of the battle. It's not that the game is fast. What he did was egregious. What he did, and, and I think he's lucky he only got two games. And when I look back at it and I and I hear the excuse, I mean, come on. Like, do you think everybody's stupid? I know some people are stupid, Jay, but not everybody, Jamie. Bottom line is you hurt your team in game three, and now they don't have you for game four and five. That hurts your team just as significantly. It's not about the heat of the battle. It's not about anything else. What you did was a poor decision, and that's as simple as that. And Just own up to it, acknowledge it, move on. And, Craig, you said it uh, on yesterday's show. You expected him to be suspended for game four. As it turns out, and you alluded to it, he's suspended for games four and five. Uh, are you happy that the Department of Player Safety was a little harder on him than just the one game? Yeah, absolutely. You know, when you, when, when you look at it, I, I thought two games – because it was basically the full game from game three when he got uh, ejected. And, and they added another game. And I think the severity of it coming down on the neck and the head of Mark Stone really led to, to the extra game. When I say the extra game, two instead of one game suspension. And, you know, he's lucky. He's lucky Mark Stone wasn't hurt. Because when Jake Evans got hit by Mark Scheifele in that playoff series versus uh, the Montreal Canadiens in 2021, Jake Evans got hurt, and Mark Scheifele paid a big price, as did the Winnipeg Jets. Jamie Benn's lucky. He's lucky that Mark Stone wasn't hurt more. Craig, we want to get your thoughts on the topic that's on everybody's mind, uh, whether they like it or not. The Leafs' general manager search. That'll come up right after the break here on Sports Center.